how to convert Solana to USDT or Theta. Hello guys, welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can swap the Solana token into Theta using our Trust Wallet. Now, as you can see here, I'm already into my Trust Wallet. I just have a few available tokens that are in here. But I'm going to make the quick swap so you can see what happened if I wanted to convert Solana into Theta. So in this case, I'm going to go into swap. I'm going to go into what I'm going to pay, which in this case, that will be Solana. I'm going to go into Sol and there's no asset found. But let's say I wanted to do that backwards. So I'm going to select, so I'm going to select Theta and I'm going to go into Sol. So as you can see, there are a few tokens that are not available into the swap. So this might be a little annoying for us guys, but the alternative that we want to do is to go into the browser and you want to tap in here where it says pancakeswap.finance slash swap. As you can see, I have this already in my history, so I'm just going to go ahead and to click this one. And now you're going to see something like this. And you're going to hit into connect. Let's connect our trust wallet. And now that we're in here, we want to select the token that we wanted to make the change for. So in this case, that would be Solana. And now I wanted to select is one that says uh, it's cake. I'm gonna, and as you can see, you just need to make this swap. Now in this case, I'm gonna show you with a little bit of token that I have here in Binance USDT, so you can see what happens. So after you've done that, you need to click into swap, and we need to confirm the swap. Uh, the price is updated, so I'm gonna go ahead and accept and accept. Now this one is gonna redirect us into our trust wallet, so we can confirm the swap. Now in this case, I need a little bit more uh, a smart chain token to cover the network fees but in this case you need to go ahead and go to connect i've made a lot of transactions in packing swap so i'm gonna go out and let's go into our wallet and you can see that your tokens are already uh, imported and updated if you don't see the token that you wanted to see you just have to click in here where it says manage token so let's say i wanted to go for solana so i'm gonna select solana and i'm gonna need to enable this one and i can see it right now in here in my wallet so there you have it guys really really simple don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this kind of stuff thank you for watching the video and i'll be seeing you guys on the next one